Setting up an account in Microsoft Outlook is fairly simple. Just go to File, Account Settings, and hit the New button to create a new account. For Gmail, you're going to want to manually configure your server settings. Hit Next, and Internet Email is what we want. Type in your name, Gmail address, and set your account type to IMAP. Set your incoming and outgoing mail servers to imap.gmail.com and smtp.gmail.com respectively. Your username is your full Gmail address and your password is your Gmail password. After that, hit the More Settings button and go to the Advanced tab. Here you'll want to set your incoming server to 993 and use SSL encryption. You want your outgoing server to be 587 using TLS encryption. After you finish that, hit the Outgoing Server tab and make sure to check the box that says My Outgoing Server Requires Authentication. It should use your regular Gmail settings automatically. Hit Next and Outlook will automatically configure your account for you. It will also send a test email to make sure everything is working correctly. When it's done, it will download all the messages in your inbox and you should be able to send and receive Gmail right from your desktop. Setting up Apple Mail is very similar. Just head to Mail's Preferences. Go to the Accounts tab and hit the plus sign in the bottom left corner of the window. This will add a new account. Type in your full name, email address, and password. After you hit continue, it might be able to set up the account automatically, but if not, choose IMAP from the menu and type a description for this account. For me, this means Lifehacker. Your incoming mail server is going to be imap.gmail.com. Your username is your full Gmail address and your password is your Gmail password. Then you'll need to set your outgoing mail server, which will be similar. Type in a description, and type in your outgoing mail server, which is smtp.gmail.com. You also want to check the Use Authentication box. After that, just hit the Create button, and mail will start downloading all your messages for you. In a few minutes, you'll have your entire inbox on your computer, and you'll be able to send and receive messages right from your desktop.